They do have their level 2s, but it will come at a price. So really good start to the uh, laning phase in the mid and in the bottom lane for IG. Erika though goes forward. He has a time dilation. This could be the first blood. The slowdown there from JT. He wants to get the first blood first and he'll be able to do it. Frisk even survives. IG, they strike down first of each game. Stun until uh, level 6 of Pango. As the bottom lane, you're into Darks here and Nyx and... Uh, oh, it's actually a rotation from supports into the mid lane. That's something that I, I actually prefer. We'll be able to do some great things, but for now he just wants to chill and farm, right? Because uh, his timings are later on. He usually... Oh, does, does he die? He dies. So, oh, Erika. A big misplay, but he miscalculated the, the speed with which... Uh, in this particular game, like, you can do a great Morphling Illusion, but that's about it. Now Xem being gone on. Yeah, and uh, they don't have enough damage to finish him off. He turns around, but Emo has a haste. They're gonna get the stun off. Oli might be going down. Xem, Plasma Field, not up. One more hit. The mana burn it will be enough. Emo still going forward. The Flame Guard should be expiring fairly soon, but it is not gonna expire until he gets the kill. Oh, it does expire right now. They're trying to slow him down. The Bushwhack not connecting. A great usage of the Quelling Blade. XM still being chased down, and the Weaver... Oh, the Juke! He breaks some ankles there, and Weaver, he has a ton of them. So beautifully done by XM. The Weaver would love to get a kill. Geoma TP out! And Vichy Gaming, they are the ones that outplay IG this time around. But IG, they finally want to go for an aggressive move. No towers have fallen just just yet, but Vici Gaming, if they start losing heroes around the mid lane, that tower will fall. Scurry on Geoma, this rolling thunder, it's probably not gonna be as useful as the other ones. He will get into the tier 2 tower and that's way too deep for JT. Having that uh, hood, it does help you against the shells, but against the uh, damage of the tower, not that much. The sun from the next, not connecting. Geoma won't be going for the sharpshooter. See if maybe Vici Gaming are gonna be going for some four stabs because sometimes they are a necessity against the uh, against the pango. Of course, the face void will be getting a BKB at some point. Ember Spirit stunned up. Uh, Nyx Assassin, he doesn't want to be here and very soon he's gonna understand that it was a big mistake. Now in the middle lane, they see this Nyx Assassin. Are they going for him? He turns into Nyx and yeah, that's a free kill for Fly Fly. Now he also sees Xiaoma and XM as well. XM is in a huge trouble and he will go down as well as his tier 1 tower in the middle lane. For them, I think that the next assassin could have used the stun there, but not sure how much it would have changed. And Nemo, he's out for blood, though uh, they're really not going to be bleeding. They're going to be burning that wall. Very nice placement. It will slow the down. Irving is still alive and Geoma comes over. This is a dive that IG might not want to make, considering that the faces void is there as well. The time dilation slowing them all down. Frisk does have his ulti. He shouldn't be dying. The bushwhack doesn't connect either. It will just connect onto the uh, creeps. And now Geoma in some trouble. Last time around, he managed to escape JT. This time around, the rolling thunder and the uh, slide of fist chains will be enough for the kill. Oli is the one that uh, secures the one for himself. Erika thinking about fighting JT. The time dilation would hurt him a lot. It gets used, but it doesn't connect on anyone. Immediate does. They know that the next assassin is there, but he already used the spike carry pace, which means that no one is afraid of you anymore. Emo, he's deciding if he wants to go in a beautiful stun from the Knicks. That might be enough to survive. Not even close. The slide of fist is enough. And now the Razor comes in just to be slaughtered as well. Erika, you better get yourself out of that one if you want to live. They have a bug on him. The bashes on Emo, not going to be enough for a kill. And now Erika is looking very much much dead. Where's the surge? I need to be faster. And Irving, he uses it on himself, says, no, bro, I'm gonna be saving myself. And he leaves the scary to die while Fly Fly was just taking all the farm that he wants. Our enemies are there, but they have no vision of them. JT, he wants to go into his ulti and finally he decides to do it. Where's the BKB on the faces void? He doesn't have it. He's gonna get whipped. So he is a very, very slow. Turns around with the Hrono and it's the one with which you have to run away. Actually, they might kill the Morphling once, but no, not even that is gonna be possible. Jump to the side. There is a tree there next to the Razor. It seems like they gave him two stone to the vacuum wall. It's gonna be quite nice with the stun connecting as well and Oli will be falling down as well. There's two heroes dead. VG Gaming, they get a big fight going their way, but the chase is on. Frisk falling down low. They do finish off the Hoodwing. Now XM without his BKB activated 
any longer emo he can take him down easily the nix assassin still being very annoying but they are chasing on to erica four seconds until he has the jump emo when are those chains gonna be up they still want to be going in just the sleight of fist isn't gonna be enough to keep him in place the stun onto the pango they want him dead their wing is in the vicinity erica comes over he takes some damage man usage beautiful the the uh bashes are they gonna be enough yes they get the kill but the chains keep him in place he burns down he drowns down and now the four Darks here will follow as well. IG, they're gonna be getting a good fight going their way, make it a great fight. They might have lost some of their heroes, but in the end, all five of Ichi Gaming will fall. Popularity and people, you know, they also figured out, you know what, Morphling is also pretty good, even outside of this matchup. Now, with Chronosphere, he doesn't get the BKB off, and maybe there's enough damage. Maybe, uh, maybe, bashes. maybe. Ooh, it's gonna be enough. They do finish him off, and Irving, he's gonna be the one getting the kill. That's 900 gold. Obviously, he would have wanted it on Erica, but, you know, not everything can go your way. Now the Weaver being chased down. Do they have the Impale? Yes, they do, but he turns back time. He's gonna have another Shikuchi in a second, and we'll have a mana for another one with nine stick charges. This Weaver is not looking like the kill, though. Guess who is? It's gonna be XM. Stun before the Rolling Thunder connects, and Fly Fly, he just has more than enough damage. Finally, the Weaver is caught. They have the Sentry, and they have the Bashes. So a two-for-one around the map. Ichi Gaming are gonna be more than happy about that. Back up, or even even more of those because this is just insane. Look at RRRRR. Just uh, stop it, my friend. Both his uh, letter R and S are not going to be looking too great. Finally, he goes in. His keyboard can't take it anymore. The next assassin with the ult should be keeping himself safe. No four staff. He's going to try to get himself close to the edge there just to prevent the damage. But finally, they do finish him off. Victoria doesn't get out of a stun. XM will be next. Swashbuckle, the next time doesn't want to use the BKB just yet with the spider legs. The razor will get himself out. There he goes in with a beautiful chrono. They're going in onto onto emo. They want him dead, and they will be able to get him. They shoot him as well. What a vacuum! Beautifully done. He buys back. Does he have a remnant? Oh, he has to go to the mid lane. Fly fly going in is taking damage away from XM and destroying him. Now the bashes on the void not gonna be good enough, and the Nyx assassin shot back into the fountain they get the Aegis down beautifully done by Irving that was just with an eye shell him and Geoma they do manage to kill Flyfly Fly, but now without the Chrono it's time to go high ground uh, Fraser survives this engagement if they man actually manage to force stop him onto the high ground uh, this high ground push doesn't happen I feel like uh, it, it would still be really hard but because of uh, because of this death it's it's now Erica who's been gone on and he's probably dead because when you're next to a wall it's really hard to be uh, without BKB and uh, yeah 74 seconds without your Poyoyo -yo, without your faces void is gonna be hard and Darks here is gonna fall as well and at this point I feel like Vichy Gaming they might consider calling it outrun anyone on the side of Vichy Gaming against the Mega Creeps I just don't see Vichy Gaming coming back into it yeah now Erica he's been gone on once again and they just call GG because they understand that this initiation is just a nail in the coffin of this game one for them but Vichy Gaming I wouldn't say that they you know they played poorly working out the kinks uh, they might have to do it for the next game if this continues in the path it's going top lane Irving giving a lot of damage to fly fly who's still going forward Geoma wants to go in it's only a level 2 dp actually she's level 3 level 2 crypt swarm can be quite strong but they finish him up before that one and IG again gonna be starting off this game quite nicely they turn around on Geoma as well and yes bring him down two minutes in you could say it's not too much but when you look at the CS you will understand that they are losing quite a lot. And Emo comes with the rotation. Minute uh, four. That's a level five Ember Spray that is rotating. They're going for Erica as well. A level three Ricky will never be able to survive this one. And they'll chase him until they finish him off. He'll jump to the side. Not even that will be allowed. And the spear through the eye of the Ricky. Nice pick against the Mars. But you need to be good enough against me for it to work. And look at this shield crash on the top lane. Frisk isn't even gonna allow that. Two attacks more. And Geoma is dead now. Irving, his damage is being taken away. And Fly Fly, he's time to whip her to back to the base. Spirit Siphon, though, it's going through. It gets to the left side, has the sticks, and Irving, there's absolutely no chance in hell that he'll be surviving this one. One more hit from Flyfly, Fly, and that's six kills for IG without losing a single hero so far. Are getting towards Vici Gaming, they will try to dive this line. They want to get a kill on the aggressive. The Inkswell will connect. It is a solid stun onto the line with the Phantom's Rave, but the TP coming in. Emo, he sees his friend die, and he's like, I'm gonna get the revenge. They're going for the DP. Irving is taking so much damage. Flyfly Fly still going for 
forward and he wants to do the damage. The Riki is here. Tricks of the trade. You will hide in the shadows for just a bit, but he doesn't even have his ulti. Let him live. It's not fair to kill him immediately. They know that XM is coming because they have a ward and a sentry seeing him and they'll just keep themselves away. XM thinking about a lasso. Do you think that he can kill the Razor next to the Wisp? The relocate is gonna come forward and that thinks well. It will oh, they push it back. Beautiful done, XM. Okay, that is a play. They could change something, but Emo still coming forward. This fight, this skirmish, it is not over. Emo wants to burn down the enemies, and the Mars is coming over. Arena is ready. He will make them fight in it. They see the Riki, the silence onto the Mars, but he's inside of the arena. Can he jump out with a spear through both of them? The Riki, he gets himself out for the time being, and Emo, he finally runs him down. He knew exactly where his enemy was. Emo now using his spirit there, the spirit siphon, it's sucking it out of him, but he is still gonna keep it in his body and the Wisp will make sure of it. Frisk though, he's not gonna be so lucky and XM gets the connection but this fight, a never ending one is continuing. JT holding his ground, the Wisp is gonna be there. I got you buddy, let's hold hands. They will not break right now and XM, he wanted to stop a friendship. He'll be able to but will be paying with his life in the end. Emo, again, the Spirit Siphon on him but with his Flame Guard, just not gonna be taking that much damage. Fly Fly, that was the shortest static link in the world. It didn't take a single damage point but Irving still the storm clouds are here it is uh, it is gonna be rainy today and Irving some tears are definitely coming down his cheek so he'll be going quite well with that lightning finally the fight will end and IG will be the victors once more he is top of the net worth and we talked about how scary he can be now frisk he might be potential setup for this relocate IO play JT is in position as well I think they are gonna do that just the two of them but now an inkswell comes out they're going on frisk frisk is an inkswell connect and frisk is dead but emo he is gonna chew into this Erika uh, small Ricky and he's gonna be probably quite successful because Ricky is not the tankiest of heroes. For now though, XM, he's just zoning everybody out from his support and Emo, he chased after two rabbits and caught none. Now, uh, chains come out from him, but uh, this, this, this the cloud and the good lasso into this cloud emo is probably dead he is dead and xm does he want to chase for more no not really oh, the blink is already enough right with blink you already have a potential for an aggressive play they see that they're going in a nice um, stun from lion and they do manage to isolate salma but he has to run jump away oh this uh, razor getting low the the wisp tried to heal him up but the double lasso pulled into their deaths and the lion will get destroyed as well vici gaming man are they stronger than ig at this point without the arena jump in if they don't destroy this bat rider you also need uh, maybe a plate mail on this uh, dp to be able to actually do something great the Vici Gaming, they're coming forward. Oh no, the Hex on Frisk! Did he really just respond like that? The Batrider is dead, this fight is over. You have to bail, run away. Just stop, stop losing heroes. It's not worth it. Frisk is too good. These Lions today are just playing out of their minds and Geoma is trying to run away. He has the Shield Crash, it's gonna prevent the burn. But the Yules now getting away. All of his Shield Crash stacks, they don't exist any longer. He does disarm the Ember Spirit, but finally he'll get his weapons back and he'll get the cut now. They want to go for the Grimstroke as well. They know exactly where he is. Emo, Slide of Fist doesn't connect. He's not going to go for a chase. But JT, he feels like there's a guy to execute on this side. Yeah, he pretty much doesn't do anything. Another creep wave is coming in. Still without the exorcism, without there's going to be a push. Frisk, they know he's in the vicinity, but they'll jump JT. The uh, Hex on the Geoma, they have the arena as well. JT, where's your PKB? He doesn't use it, and because of it, they won't be able to save the line. XM will be the one that gets the connection on the kill, and IG pushed back into their base. They were the ones that were hold holding a lead just a few minutes ago. Him killing the Pango could be your move, but he has a Yult, he has an A on this, he has the roll-up. It's uh, almost impossible. Possible to do it now threatening with the rolling thunder xm just going forward fly fly broken the lincolns they catch him and the io has been caught or has he finally the relocate is there this is the thing that ig have been waiting for for such a long time he was trying to create space behind on the map and the arena comes out jt will get a kill on the grimstroke that's the first kill of the fight now going for the dp they're trying to get her damage away and this is there the spirits aren't going to be doing any damage and vg gaming they get themselves out irving he eats a finger but he doesn't care he's really not taking that much damage the spirit doesn't connect a lot of anger breaking but in the end he will fall surrounded by so many heroes when IG get the relocate off big deal you jump on him and uh, he's gonna have just so much status resistance the first
the tier 3 falls, and now the first lane of Rax could be in some trouble. They're gonna go in with the lasso. The Mars is looking very much dead. Can they relocate? Be there, uh, be out in time? No, that's not gonna be happening. Golly comes in. He's way too deep, and he'll be going down as well. Fly, fly, BKB is ready. He's going for the Raxes. Erika is starting the cleanup. I think IG, you have to get yourselves out with the TP out. Fly, fly should be able to survive. No bashers and emo. He doesn't have any more remnants. Does have the blink though. TP out immediately. No things to cancel his TP, and he will survive. Top uh, like several times in a row, winning several fights all by himself pretty much that that's what led to this situation erica now being gone on yeah, and they have the lasso onto the Mars. They're trying to finish him off. He's taking a lot of damage. Where is the Wisp? He's inside of the smoke screen. And he can't do anything but fly, fly. Going onto the Bat Rider, trying to finish him off. He's taking a lot of damage. No one dying just yet. They still have the Aegis. They still have the cheese. And Ollie will die. Now fly, fly is left alone. He doesn't have the help of the Wisp. It will be cut down. Erika, he loses one of his lives. But a small price to pay. There's the bash. Well played, fly, fly. You have the basher, but it's going to do absolutely nothing. You don't kill a single hero. And you lose three in that fight. It was a long one. Emo not being able to to finish off anyone jt he has the satanic gods rebuke you are not gonna do it without the mana and being silenced up in the smoke screen this mars he wants a fair fight but the ricky throws smoke in his eyes and he will not be able to get a response you mean come from uh, they have all the control in the world they have quite a lot oh now except being gone on the relocate, the relocate will be there. They won't be able to finish off the Mars. We already saw fights go like this. Vichy Gaming, they have to bail, but Emo is already in. He doesn't have the BKB, and he has the Divine Rapier. Yes, I would like that one. Ricky would like the big sword that is inside, but JT, he's protecting it. He's protecting it for his buddy, but his buddies are dead. He will pick it up. He can't use it, though. That's too big of a sword for him. Even a God of War is not going to be able to use it. And here comes Fly Fly with a refresher. He has the Abyssal Blade. Is he going to have another one? No, he doesn't see the Death Prophet. He knows where she is, and the the ghosts are hunting him down. Fly Fly will get haunted to death. They use the finger. They finish off Irving, but she's gonna be coming back if she wants to. Without the exorcism, though, probably doesn't want to fight the buybacks from IG. Not gonna be enough. And JT, at least he saves the big sword. Emo. Go that uh, nobody else uh, knows. Now is it's Ember is back. Oh, JT being gone on. JT. JT places her arena, tries to get out, and he will not be successful. Oh, so my, so my, they, they find. They find Ember Spirit GG is called immediately. He understands. The moment he is being gone on, the game is over. Yeah, he got caught immediately. Geoma, really, uh, for me, the definite MVP. lane as, as a DK, you can survive and you're not going to be going down, especially with the stick. But, oh, bottom lane, the spin was there, they're going forward, they want to get the first button, IG will get it, but Frisk will die. What a crit from Erika, he knew exactly when he needed to cut down this next assassin and he does get a uh, return kill, but the first blood still goes into the uh, hands of IG. It's a bit of nerfs showing, uh, he knew, he saw where Jarkseer is in this lineup, right? And um, he didn't need to spin, even if he eats a stun in, those, in this situation, he's a Okay, now Zioma uh, getting dangerously low, misses his uh, swarm, but uh, I feel like Frisk should be going down in the end. It's, one. it's a bit of a uh, more expensive item, but once he does get it, it will be a big deal. All he comes over and this Juggernaut spin TP out will not be successful. It looked to me like a very long TP and Emo will just wait for his chance to execute the Juggernaut. Erika, a big mistake. He was stopping the network chart before this one, but Emo... It's not going to be there. It just takes too long. Mm, you don't want to kill Darks here because he's kind of a low value, but you're probably just losing your Irving and that's about it. And they lost Irving and Michi Gaming now when they see that one. They're probably going to get super demoralized. IG could go for a smoke. You don't want to be staying too long on the top lane with so many heroes. Fly Fly actually runs into the high ground. Kill on the Nyx or 80 gold. But you're going to have to hold that thought. We'll give you time to think about it because Fly Fly is going to get gone on. He dodges the Inkswell. For now, it's already taking too long. The TP's from IG. They're going to start coming over. Fly Fly, this is going to take way too long. He'll die the once or will he? Okay, he goes down there. Not the best arm of the toggle coming out from him. And Michi Gaming, they have to bail. Spin into a TP, Bane is not in the vicinity, they'll get themselves out, but the, this guy doesn't have a spin, which means the Dragon will be caught. Also, same can be said for the Grimstroke, he's pretty much dead, and they know that the Dragonite has nowhere to go. No mana, no HP, they'll run him down, and with the Surge, this Raid King is just gonna be cutting him down, a king slaying a big beast. Usually he sends his knights to do so, but this time around, he will be doing the hunting himself. J Does he just go, go, go? Does he wait for Blink uh, as soon as possible on this Phrase King? Or are they content just delaying it? 
as long as possible and just winning the late game. How how is it actually like how is uh, this? Oh now never mind. There's an attack on the storm spirit. He is getting phantoms of rage. There is Inkswell connecting as well. Roar and yep, yeah, they finally get the biggest kill in the game. Yeah, and it wasn't even the roar expanded. This could have been a double roar as well. Uh, Vici Gaming, they have the opportunity to go into the Roche pit. XM though, chasing for more. He's trying to burn down Flyfly. Fly. The dragon is hungry, but Flyfly Fly, uh, actually has no meat, and the dragon finally understands. Nope, uh, nope, this is not that good one. Farming deep in, in your own territory and just playing defensively, feeding supports. And it, it, it looks like they are going with the uh, option of feeding both scores instead, and uh, that's also an option. Yeah, that, that is a good option for sure. XM will get the Dragon Tail off. Suddenly he loses his BKB and uh, here comes the the uh, Beast Master as well. One. Kill me, kill me please. I don't want to live without my cores. There's no reason for it. And IG, they're just so damn merciful. They will make their wishes come true immediately. Emo loses the Aegis, but again, very small price to pay. They get four. So for it to have a massive impact, but the overall it's it's a way to dispel the, what is it called? To dispel the Orchid. So with this orchid being dispelled he's no longer a target for storm to go in on and because he's not the Z storm oh no they're kidding oh no please uh um uh, yeah that was a freebie uh in, in response he has what it takes to bait in the storm spread they're going in with the inkswell the science on the grim stroke is that inkswell with the shards no it's not the roar on the storm but they lost the juggernaut they don't have the damage the dpl from emo don't do this to them please emo don't be so good but he's gonna say i'm gonna be even better than you thought i could ever be he gets himself out the vacuum the stun from the nix the wall is there and the cleanup will come you attempted to kill our storm you attempted to bait vici gaming they let their DK down in the bottom lane so that they can bait IG on the top lane. But uh, that uh, it's impossible not to do that, right? He is in the front, and how do you catch the backline? There is no way if the backline catches you. Yeah, and XM, he does catch the backline. Bane is caught. He immediately goes for the Fiend's Grip, raises his arms. He is celebrating, but not celebrating fast enough. It has XM. He does survive, but not for long. He lost his BKB, meaning that the magic damage will be there. Finishing off the DK will be an easy peasy play for Emo. He is uh, continuing to destroy VG Gaming, and they finally they admit defeat. This game is out of their hands. Ever since the bottom lane went so badly, and the Darkseer and the Nix Assassin outdid themselves, VG Gaming. Thank <laughs> you.